We want to grow the player base for VR-based esports, so we get those pro players of the future in the pipeline and ready to go. We've been hard at work putting the final touches on our on our upcoming VR experience, Lone Echo, a single-player game where you play uh, a cybernetic AI on a mining station in the rings of Saturn. We built an experience where you can interact with everything around the world. You can uh, just navigate in free, uh, freely in zero G, and you uncover the mysteries that unfold before you. With the mechanics we built for Lone Echo, we wanted to know what more we could do for VR. So we created a multiplayer game, a full contact futuristic VR sport where up to 10 players in two teams must get a disc inside the opposing goal. Echo Arena, I mean, that looks, that looks pretty fun. I'm pleased to announce today that we are sponsoring a free release of Echo Arena, and that's going to be at launch on to all Oculus Rift users. So we were able to do that. Lone Echo is available for pre-order right now on the Oculus Store at $39.99. Lone Echo and Echo Arena will both be released on July 20th. And I'm pleased to announce today that we're going to expand our partnership with ESL and Oculus to launch the VR Challenger League. And it's gonna take place online, in an events all around the world with players, and it's gonna culminate with the finals of the Challenger League happening at Intel Extreme Masters in Poland. This is your traditional 2D streaming I, type technology. I think everybody recognizes that. But now with VR and new movement forward in the tech industry, we're looking to share that same gaming experience, but we can't really do it like this. We're looking to be able to put someone in mixed reality view and be able to share a in the game experience with All everyone right. out there. I am hanging out in mixed reality right now, and this is amazing. The first time that anyone is going to be seeing this gameplay, uh, I'm probably going to be getting my ass kicked right now. Well, we're really excited to bring you this VR experience that's never been seen or done before. We're looking forward to working with Spatial Land and uh, creating a VR destination for all Lincoln Park fans everywhere. It's going to be the best out there and uh, we're looking forward to it. So have fun at E3. We're just scratching the surface today of what's to come. You can expect more of this kind of work from Intel and all of our partners.